everyone, this is me, Roseanne. I hope everyone is doing well. I wanted to come on here and show you um, what I've been working on. So um, I have created two more lanterns and um, I created them Halloween. So I'm gonna show you the first one. This is my first one. And I used the um, spider web um, uh, collection uh, 31 that I just uh, purchased from uh, Felicia here on YouTube, FP Handmade. Um, so I created uh, this lantern with that actual um, 12 by 12. And I added some flowers that I also got from her. And I got this and this and this. I actually painted it with some, with marker. I got these at the Dollar Tree. So it was a package of wooden stickers. And I pretty much used uh, quite a bit of them. Uh, let's see here they go I have two left I have the house and two bats the bat this bat was this color as well and I just went over it with the marker but I wanted to show you that I created this and I want to be I'm going to be sending this out for a happy mail um, and then inside I created some embellishments so I really went outside the box and I really used what I had. I kind of was searching for different things and I really wanted to utilize all the stuff I have because I have so much of it that I really wanted to use it. So this holds quite a bit of um, uh, embellishments. Um, so the first embellishment that I created, I made it out of this photo frame and I got this idea from, um, vividly on paper, Crystal. Hi, Crystal. If you're watching, um, she made a couple of these for a, on her channel and I went and I looked to see if I had the die and I did. I actually have both. Excuse me. Oh, it's late. I need to go to bed. Um, Anywho, I just went ahead and made my own mix inside and I put uh, a piece of the um, paper from 31. This is part of the paper um, I just backed it on and then I did another one and um, backed it on to finish it off in the back. So this was one that I created. I made a rosette and cut it down smaller added this um, saying um, and then the next one I made was this one and this one has bats in it and I made the sequence mix also I think I could have added more I'm not real good with making shakers but I try um, I probably could have added way more um, I just did a rosette here one of the uh, pumpkins from the collection and then I put pumpkin there and backed it up with some glitter ribbon I also created uh, this one, and this one came from the uh, stamp, Fun Stampers Journey. I got this on their site when they had like a $2, $1 sale. I think I paid $2 for this. So I made that, and all I did was this was part of that wooden uh, sticker that I got at, excuse me, I'm so sorry, at the Dollar Tree. And I created that and then I kind of like I said I really want to use my dies because I have so many of them I created this window it looks like a frame it was started off as a window um, but it looks like a frame now um, with this um, now this would cut out all the little intricate um, cuts there but I used really thick paper so it kind of like cut them and didn't come out correctly so I went ahead and cut them off and just use it as a frame 
colored the bat from the Dollar Tree. This is part of the uh, 31 collection. And those are the embellishments I made. I used a uh, Dollar Tree uh, sticker that I found for that as well. And these pop right inside. So this is a pretty good uh, size of a box to add some stuff in there. So I will be sending that off. I think it turned out cute. Let me know what you all think. Here's a spider and the two uh, flowers. And then I used that um, spool of, um, kind of looks like web that I got at, uh, what is it called? Uh, Ross for 49 cents. And this one here, I also did Halloween because I'm going to be busy um, the month of Halloween. Uh, that's the month my daughter's uh, baby shower is. So this is the next one. And now I use this collection that I got from Felicia as well. Um, I just wrapped the um, that ribbon that looks like a it looks like um got all kinds of things sticking to me. It looks like the web. I put it on the bottom. I put a spider here, added some flowers, and then I just wrapped the um, ribbon with some glue dots. And then I added this little guy, which this came from the collection of ephemera I just got from her, Pebbles. Um, and then I added a witch on top with another witch and the person that I'm giving this to that is me and her <laughs> I think it's so cute and I think she'll get a kick out of it so the top I decorated I just added some of the um Dollar Tree trim and I mean the Dollar Tree um spool of uh tool I guess this here um, and then I just gathered it and added a little witch that's flying on her broom. So, um, I added this pom-pom trim. I added this I've had forever from Michaels. Uh, it, this one was not pre-stuck. This one was, it came with, um, the adhesive in the back. So I just added the adhesive to this one. So this excuse me so sorry um this was really cute to make and it was double-sided paper so the inside looks like that and i haven't finished making all of the ephemera for the inside that i'm going to be putting but i did make one i made another shaker same thing just different colors and uh i made this a little shaker and then um out of the inside of this um came uh, this so I made this little twinchy I need to put a saying I'm not done yet with this and I'm not done with this one so I'm gonna also make this one a shaker as well and then I have this little guy left over here too so I'm gonna add him on there and make two twinchies out of that just not to waste it you know so those are my little ephemeras that I made that I'm going to be sticking in here and um, I did buy a light because I wanted to see it lit up um, but I think a tea light is much better so I did, haven't gone to the Dollar Tree and uh, since I went a couple days ago to get a, I forgot all about excuse me the tea lights so um Here's the second one. Let me know what you think. Um, I just wanted to jump on because I think this one, I really love the pink um, Halloween. But I think this one is my favorite because it's just so much fun. It's so much fun, especially the two on the top. Um, like I said, that's me and her um, dancing. Um, and I think she's going to get a kick out of that. Anyways, let me know what you all think. Um, really having fun with just digging into my dyes, um, and, uh, creating with what I have. 
and what I bought which is the D stash. Okay, have a good night. Bye-bye now.